Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, and if you're new, welcome. Hi, I'm Shannon, I hope you're all doing well. You can probably guess from the title, yes, we are doing another H&M haul. So my last haul, which I'm gonna actually pop on the iCards for you. So my last haul, I pretty much said that I hadn't shopped from H&M in literally the longest time. And I was so obsessed with the items that I actually purchased that I was like, I really need to do another haul because like, honestly, H&M are doing bits, spoiler alert, I pretty much love nearly every single piece on here and that's really not gonna be good for my bank balance. Like, please can you let me know in the comments down below what your favorite items are because I'm really struggling with what I should actually keep and what I should send back. If you do like me and if you do like this video, don't forget to subscribe, hit the thumbs up and smash that bell so you can be notified every time that I upload a new video that helps me out massively. Okay, so the first item that I bought was this really cute like wrap around cardigan thing. So this is really nice like gray color. Um, and what it does is it wraps around just like a normal wrap around. You'll see it better in the try on clip. But what I really loved about it was when you wrap it the first time around, it has this like detail in here so you can like pull one of the wrap arounds a lot more tighter if that makes sense so you can choose how like loose or tight fitted that you want the like wrap detail so i'll make sure that everything that i purchase will be linked in the description box for you so that you can go and shop them for yourself if you do really like the outfit i did find that this was quite itchy it wasn't the softest knitwear material however it does look really cute on i do find a lot in autumn slash winter i don't look as put together as the warmer months so when it gets a bit colder I, i'm not gonna I do kind of look like a slob and a lot of the time I just look comfortable you know I don't look as fashionable as I kind of wish that I would like I'm jealous of the people that end up looking amazing all year round especially in autumn winter although like I love autumn winter and it's like one of my favorite times of the year just getting cozy and snuggly I just feel like I lack on just looking as stylish as a lot of people but with this like wrap around top it's so it's so effortless you know you can look a lot nicer okay so the next item that i bought that i was i was literally obsessed with and it's this oversized like sweater and it has alice in wonderland in and i thought this was so nice like look at the color and look how massive it is and i think i got it in my normal size yeah i got it in a small i gauged it basically on what it looked like on the website and the model was wearing a size small and it looked like really big really oversized so i was like okay if it looks really big on her then surely it's gonna you know look quite oversized on me and i'm so happy i did they don't advertise it as being an oversized sweatshirt though but it just how it looked on her it was a lot bigger do you know what i mean this is really nice like um beigey stone camel however you call it you know i'm really bad at explaining colors but this was so nice like it's really big you're going to be able to see it a lot more in the try on clip but it is massive it's so cozy as well it comes up a lot higher so it's like a higher crew neck if you know what i mean so it comes up a lot higher they have a nice drop sleeve detail in here it's just so nice like can you see the detail here of like this little like rouging bit on the arm it's just it was so cozy so comfortable part of me just thinks that that was the only like alice in wonderland kind of theme and disney theme design you know i, I don't know do you know what today's not a good day like i'm really struggling to get my words out <sighs> Okay, so the next item that I purchased was actually some pyjamas. The one thing that I mainly forget to always purchase is like new pyjamas because to be honest, like when you buy a nice pair of pyjamas, they last every year. Do you know what I mean? I don't know about you, but I will wear my pyjamas until there's a hole in them. Like I have a pair of like pyjama trousers since I was like 12 and they're, they're still going strong. I mean, they have a few stains on them, like food stains and tea stains and whatever. No one's gonna see me in them. Do you know what I mean? So I don't really care if they, they look really like jacked up you know i just don't buy pajamas enough um primark is normally my go-to place to buy pajamas to be honest and i saw this and it was really nice like the material of it i think it was like a brushed cotton i think a lot of uh, places advertise this material as like soft touch soft feel and it's just i just loved it and it also as well it's really long i think it's long to the point where it covers your bum area and it has these split details on the side here it's a really nice like form fitted like fit but because of the material Material of it being soft you don't feel suffocated you don't feel uncomfortable like it's really nice so in the autumn winter months i don't actually wear jeans i don't really wear joggers the main item that i wear on my bottom half is leggings and just like oversized jumpers because it's just cozy it's comfy it's convenient it's easy it's quick do you know what i mean if you wanted to run down the shop especially in the evening as well so not only during the day do i wear leggings a lot of the time i wear it as pajamas as well i just find it so easy a lot comfier like it just molds to your body do you know like i, I don't know if you agree 
This is just so much better than leggings in itself. So it is like a legging, but it's because of the material of the soft touch, soft feel material. Honestly, this is so nice. It has this really nice cuff detail here. So it cuffs at the bottom of your ankle. This is like the coziest thing ever, like sitting on your couch, on your sofa, whatever, watching your favorite program, cup of tea, hot chocolate, biscuits. It's just like, it's a treat. Like I said, I don't know if, if, if any of you can actually relate, but honestly, I'm a leggings kind of girl. I don't really wear joggers a lot. And if that's your sort of cup of tea, I highly recommend. A lot of people I do find as well can be very self-conscious of their bum. Um, So I like the fact that the top half, it covers your bum. So I'm not really fussed. I don't care. I don't mind if my bum is like showing when I'm wearing leggings. This is ideal for people that are very self-conscious of having their bum on show. So what is a haul without a pair of jeans? Even though I just basically granted that I rarely wear jeans in autumn winter. What I did like about these, so they are skinny jeans, but they are a cargo jean. And here they are. So it's just this nice pair of black jeans and it's like cargo pant-esque. So like you have your pockets here. Are they real po pockets? Oh my God, they are. Yes, real pockets, which is a massive thumbs up from me. These are very, very nice. I think I got them in a bigger size. Yeah, so I got them in a size eight because the last H&M haul that I had, I got a lot of my jeans in a size six and I just felt that they were too snug. They just felt too small. Even though I am a size six, maybe size up with H&M jeans. I don't know if any of you have had that experience with H&M jeans being a bit more smaller. I do remember actually speaking about it in my last haul saying that, has anybody had this? So I just thought, I'm gonna go for a size eight and just test the waters. These fit amazingly perfectly. They are really nice. They fit nicely as well. Um, I am, like I keep saying in every single bloody haul, that I am trying to venture into different styles. I know these are skinny jeans, but the fact that they are kind of like cargo-y kind of pants i just really liked them if that's your sort of style i highly recommend because it's really really nice the next three items which are really exciting because they're like jackets h&m is where it's at if you want to get some nice jackets like they have everything so they have like your really nice tailored jackets they have your like slouchy like relaxed fit jacket they just have something for every occasion so i picked this one up and it was a was it like a sterling a faux sterling jacket i think that's how you call it but i'm gonna have to move back a little bit so you can see the full effect of this because this is stunning i've noticed that i've got a lot of beige and neutrals i told you i've become kind of like a neutral person as me like wearing this kind of color as well like i've always been into your blacks and grays and whites and now i've like even up here like my washing's up here like what the hell like i yeah i think i'm a new person this jacket kind of reminds me of like right it's 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 not raining outside but it's cold and it's like early in the morning and it's not freezing but it's not like hot it's still cold you know um if that even makes any sense and this reminds me of like taking your dog for a walk obviously i don't have a dog kind of wish i did but we live in a flat so that's not really allowed. Yeah, so this just reminds me of like, I'm taking my dog for a walk and I love this. So I love this like little print. I love the fact that they copied it with um, the pocket detail in here. And also they have it just around the collar as well. I just really loved it. I love the contrast of colors. Oh, and also as well, they have it on the zip detailing down here. And they have the really nice cozy material inside brushed cotton, fleece line, cotton line. I never know. Do you know what? I need to do my research on what that material is because I, I, I think I am getting it wrong. Like I generally do think I'm getting it wrong. This is just, honestly, I could sleep with this. This is how cozy it is. It's very, very oversized. So I am very petite. I'm five foot three and I'm a size six. And I got this in a size small. I can't remember if they come in an extra small. I don't think they did. But yeah, it is very, very oversized. Very, very cozy. But just keep that in mind. It came past my bum area. So if you do like that oversized slouchy jacket kind of vibe, I 100% recommend this. Honestly, like I said, H&M, the coats, the jacket is where it's at. I could have spent so much on there. But it's just, yeah, I... I my bank account would not be thanking me like 
no my bank account isn't thanking me now do you know what i mean but right so the next item that i got i actually wore this today because we went to the shops today but i left the tag on because i'm not 100 sure if i'm going to keep it because it's it is up there in price for what it is but the quality and how warm it kept me was just astounding here it is again i've got another like i think this is more like a brownie mink color my hair literally just attaches itself to everything. On the extra colder months, you could use this under a coat. So you could wear this and then a coat over it, which is how I actually tried it on this morning because I thought outside was a lot colder than what it was. It was cold enough to wear this on its own but not cold enough to shove a jacket over it. It has a nice hood on it. It's very, very oversized. I think I got this in a smaller size as well. Yeah, I got it in a size small. So you just have a zip detail in here. It's actually quite low. So it came to about, I would say here, on me the zip detailing. But honestly, love this, obsessed with it, kept me warm. So right now, the autumn months, it is cold enough to the point where you can just wear this on its own. It kind of depends how you are when it comes to the cold weathers. Like I, I get cold easily like any sort of breeze i'm like i start having like a shivering fit you know like <laughs> i could be uber cold all the time so it really depends so for me i'm like the weather now is perfect for this well the weather that we've just had today and yesterday so today actually let me just give you the date um so today is actually the 11th of october so it was perfect for the weather that we had on the 11th of october that's actually one thing i need to say is i don't know if any of these items are in stock when i do link them just purely because with everything that's going on again there's a lot of delays with deliveries i think this took me nearly two weeks to get so i know h&m zara etc are taking a lot longer to process stuff because of new regulations and new, new things happening fingers crossed these are in stock once this video goes live but i hope so because honestly these pieces are amazing and i can't recommend these things enough i just it's just what i don't know whether to keep it just purely because of the last jacket i just showed you and i've got another jacket i'm going to show you and it's just a bit like do i keep it do i not i don't i don't know i don't know so let me know in the comments down below what you think i should do and which one i should keep because it's really it's messing my mind okay last but not least we have this beautiful beautiful jacket so in the autumn winter i am very much of a person that likes to go for kind of like slouchy fits very like oversized jumpers and oversized jackets like the last two that i've shown I kind of go for the more like tomboy kind of like masculine kind of look and like a granddaddy kind of look pretty much i like my granddaddy kind of like jumpers i never really tend to look as feminine or as chic in the autumn winter months and i kind of want to because i feel like i go very very feminine very very girly during the summer and spring months but when it comes to autumn and winter again i am a comfy kind of person i dress to be comfortable i don't dress well comfortable and warm should i say i dress to be comfortable and warm i don't really dress to look nice you know because I just, I just, I suffer really bad when it's cold. That's all I'm saying. Like, I I just struggle so much. But with this jacket, I just felt like this is a step in the right direction of being chic and looking a bit feminine. Um, although it's like a tailored fit, you see what I mean. So here is the jacket. Oh my God, this is actually super heavy holding it up. It's hurt my arms. Yeah, so here is the jacket. I don't know if you're gonna be able to see very well. It is double breasted, which I love anything that's double breasted on blazers and jackets and just, mm, it's just really nice. Again, I've always been someone that's into like grays and blacks. I don't know, I tend to go for a lot of darker colors, but I'm just like, why not get a jacket that's this colour? Because not being funny, it's neutral. It's going to go with everything, you know. It doesn't matter what colour jumper you've got underneath. You could have a nice red jumper underneath. This is going to be fine with it, you know. Like, And because I'm stepping out the boat and like buying a lot of neutrals. This was, I think, $49.99, which I'm actually really impressed with that price. Good quality coats. They're never cheap. They're never going to be cheap, you know. You can find affordable coats and you can find affordable good quality coats but it's so hard to come by and coats sell out like that like there's a lot of coats on asos that went on sale and i was like i really need to buy some and all my sizes were out of stock which is just super annoying a 49.99 is literally like such an amazing price like can you actually go wrong with a coat that price it's so heavy amazing quality as well so thick 
it doesn't have obviously like your really nice like cottony material that i do rave about in pretty much everything you can wear like a thin top hoodie and then this perfect i think i've got this in a small as well yeah i got it in a small so these are very very oversized it's massive on me to be honest i don't mind that because it gives me a lot of like room to work with to put stuff underneath it really thick cozy jumpers i just think this is so nice i think this color is such an easy way to make you look chic and make you look more feminine it's very very easy to lose sight of you know trying to look nice or whatever in this colder month okay so that's it for the haul that's all the pieces that i bought i hope you liked it i will always always make sure that all the links are in the description box for you so if you want to go and shop them for yourself go ahead the links are just down there for you i really hope that you like this again knowing me my camera is low on battery it's about to die so i'm going to quickly just say thank you so much for watching i hope you like this and if you did like this video don't forget to subscribe hit the thumbs up smash that bell so you can be notified every time I post a new video and I hope that I get to see you in my next video. Thank you. Bye.